see where our third cup's gonna be. Let's see if this for the moment. I know I want I wanna buy the garage now for perfect too, don't I? Look at the map here. There's garages. I think the garage is up here, isn't it? There's a garage. Uh, there's a garage. There's a garage. Yeah, there it is right there. So that's where we want to go. That's not, that's not too bad. Because I want to buy a garage. You can let me pull the water out here. Yeah. So that you don't spill it and make a mess, okay? Alright, so we're good to go here. Yes, it's mac and cheese. Yum, 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 yum. Right. You're going to try them? No, no. You don't eat like that. You, you, we'll put the pasta in it first. All right, so this is only 14 miles. Okay, so let's head to this garage now. Mac and cheese. Oh. We did use our skill points, so now I just have to, um... No, no, no! Let's keep it over. Keep it over. See, you're already spilling the dabs, all right? Keep it over the pot. Okay? Let me know when you're done stirring. I'm done doing it. It's ready. It's ready for pasta? Okay. Give me a minute here and I'll get the pasta. We'll clean it. Just we'll clean it up. Yes, run, get, put it in this bathroom sink and run water over it. Rinse it out in the bathroom sink. I can't abs. You do. Go put it in the bathroom sink for me, please. Just put it in the bathroom sink. Your step stool's right there. You can go get it yourself. Oh, Jesus. Oops. <laughs> Good thing you saved the game. <laughs> oh boy, I can't even drive in the parking lot. That's amazing. another out no not too bad we haven't had too many outtakes that we needed for today fortunately all right there we go all right so go ahead let's try this again oh uh, let's try move move let's try this again here okay it's all clean okay leave it in this uh, leave it um here leave it on the counter over here so it dries all right good How about we pop it? Eh, you know what? That's the... Uh... It's all done being stirred. We just gotta stir the pasta now, that's all. Can I do the pasta? Yes, in a minute. Let me get to my, uh, what will be my new garage here. Okay. I forgot I need to do this. That takes. Okay. Uh, of course, it's taking me too long to get out of this parking lot. Now I'm stuck in traffic. Uh, we're going after this tour bus, yeah.
fairly close. Um, my job fairly close. Um, I need to vanish. Okay. I shouldn't have to worry about. Um, Oh look, rain! I think it's the first time it's raining since we've been in New Mexico. Um, shouldn't have to worry about resting. Let's certainly double check that. Raining, but yet it's sunny out. Okay, that's very interesting. Sun shower. Right on the edge of the storm somewhere. No, ah, no, we're not. <laughs> well, that, that, that's one of the things I really. Oop, let me get in here. Um, it was really, really neat, I guess you could say. Uh, about being. What's neat about being out in this area is that you can literally see for miles upon miles upon miles. You know, we're here on the East Coast, it's, you, 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 you can't. I mean, here you, you get out on the road, you get out to the desert, you can literally see 10, 20 miles away because the land is completely flat. There's nothing to put at your view. So just to, just to be out there and see these massive, huge thunderstorms, out there in the distance, you can just see the whole cloud, everything. I mean, you can see the rain coming from the cloud, the lightning. And you know, it, it, you know, it's 20 miles away from that. It's just, it's just an incredible sight. And just to see it mar march across the desert, it's really incredible. Hey, Trucker Taz is back. Hey, Taz. You made it. Yeah, I got started a little late today, Taz. I'm sorry. And I, 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 I misfigured the time anyway. I, I was off an hour. It would have been 1 o'clock your time if I had started on time to begin with. But hey, thanks for stopping by now. I think we got time for one more run here. One more run if I can get up here and get my garage box and see what we got coming up. Oh, you're, you're making some food there now, too? What time? 1 p.m. your time. Yeah, 7 p.m. Yeah. I missed it by an hour. I misfigured counting my food by an hour. I don't want anything. Thank you. I, 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 will, I will have the mac and cheese. The mac and cheese is almost done. Busy day at the hobby too. Oh yeah. I can imagine. Alright, this is oh no, where is oh here it is. Oh wow, look at that. That's a fancy brick garage it is. Oh, look at this. Truck headquarters, you betcha. Yeah, you betcha by golly by wow, it's my truck headquarters here. Alright, let's swing on into Albuquerque. Alright, yeah, swing on in here to our uh, HQ. Or what's going to be our HQ in a minute? It's 180,000. Sounds good to me. Really want to buy this garage? Yes, yes, I do. There we go. Ourselves a new garage. Oh, that's the backside. Okay. 
somebody's in bay three, how well I guess they could back out. Alright, yeah, I suppose. Alright, let's let's go ahead and pull on in here. Get out of the rain. Oh. I didn't realize it turned my wipers off. Let's look at our fancy dancy garage in here. Ah, look at that, baby. We are moving up in the world now. Mm -mm -mm. Interesting. Sweet. All right. Tomorrow it's closed, and many came today. Oh, yeah. I can imagine. Oh, well, you guys are lucky that you're closed on uh, Christmas Eve. Mm -hmm. There we go. Sweet. So, yes, yeah, so we went from tiny. Now we have a small. Excellent. All right. Um, we can't hire anybody yet? Oh, here we go. I was curious. Monica. Hello, Monica. You've got a very poor driver rating. Hmm. Uh, well, you can do just uh, you can do fuel efficiency just in time and fragile. Okay, that's it, huh? Well, perhaps next time, Monica. I gotta get a truck first. Peterbilt Kenworth. Where's Peterbilt at? It's Kenworth. There's Peterbilt. Oh, there's a pier built right in here. Let me see something here. Okay. You guys got to be. Where is the dealer in here? Where are you? Oh, well, you're down here, aren't you? Like curiosity, because you might as well pick up a Peter built too. That way we got to. Oh, you got to play with Play-Doh? Yeah. All right. Well, anyway, let's get let's get this job done because we do want to try to have some time left for. Okay, okay, okay. We would see some folks, but not the usual quantity. So it's better to close up for a day. See, it's. I guess you guys are lucky over in Europe. People actually stay the heck home on the holidays. I can guarantee you my store, I work for Target. And, you know, obviously we're open tomorrow. I think we're open until like 8 o'clock in the evening. So we're going to be open from 7 to 8. I can guarantee you we are going to be swamped, packed from the moment we open the doors uh, until, until such a time, 8 o'clock comes and we're throwing people out of the store because we want to close and go home. So yeah, that's that's the way things run here in America in retail. It's not yeah, not very pleasurable at all. That's why an old uh, an old manager who was there when I first started years ago. Um, it was at one point on a Christmas Eve. And you know, we're getting close to closing time. I think at that time we even closed at six o'clock in the evening then. Um, You know, people were still filing through the door, and we're closing in like you know, 10, 15 minutes. And he, he's just, he's just there. He said, he, he, he eventually he said, it's like people have 365 days to get to this point. It's like you, you need to do your Christmas shopping now. <laughs> you know, it's like, come on, seriously. <laughs> Ten minutes before we close, six o'clock in the evening on Christmas Eve, and you're doing your Christmas shopping now. You had 365 days to do it. Now they don't stay home. It's hobby shoot. Oh, shooting range. Ah, ah. Okay. Nice. Okay. Yeah. So, so you're. I guess you're a little bit luckier. Yeah. You're. You're a, bit, a little bit luckier in that point. In that aspect. Then. All right. So we did, we took a job to Gallup, but it was not a present job. So we should be able. Oh, that just makes it. That's 152 miles there. Um, can't believe this is that's the only job that we have for presents. Well, 
here's another one to not shallow. Ooh, that's a little bit too long. You see, now we're really getting into the long ones here. 600 miles. I didn't get it yet. I'll get it in a minute. He wants to see what job he comes to here. So yeah, let's, let's head back to Gallup, so that'll be perfect. Gallup, Gallup, where are you, Gallup? There we go. Let's, so, ah, look! This, this may I, be our first Walter job. I put Mary Poppins on. You put Mary Poppins on? But yeah. you're putting all these movies on, and I don't think you've watched five minutes of any movie you put into that. I mean, seriously, what's the point? If you're not going to be watching movies, let's turn them off. Turn off the TV and stuff, Abs. There's no point. Erin, turn off the movies and the TVs and stuff. She's not even watching them anyway. Um, this doesn't matter. You should be pretty close to Walbert, I think. Garage. Garage. Well, you know, let me see. Let me check the map here. I wish we could zoom in on this on this job map here. Oh yeah, we're right next door to Wal the Walbert. Sweet. Stop. Stop. I'm going to drive over there right now. Might as well just head right in there. And then I can pick up the job right there. Come on, Mouse. Uh, you got Ariel all cleaned up? Good. Yep, Ooh, I knew that was. Yeah, it's a little bit, Daddy. That's a little bit. Okay. Come on. There we go. Well, I don't. Ha it's in the refrigerator. I don't even know if we got a drink ready for you. I want you, Daddy. Well, check the refrigerator. You know, I think I put a cup in there. Check the refrigerator for your cup of juice. It's no, Marley's not going to get your mac and cheese. Not with me sitting here. Although sometimes we have to wonder about that dog. Yeah, I guess not too many people would go shooting on a, a Christmas Eve. They'd probably do their Christmas shopping, right? Uh, but yeah, so yeah, it's nice to be able to sit home, relax with the family. Thank God this is my normal weekend off. Um, after I finished last night doing a bit of a stream, I, my Atlas Reactor stream, had to wrap, uh, had to wrap a, a couple of gifts we got for the kids. Wow. Just in case Santa Claus doesn't show up for them. Wow. Because you guys want to open some presents, right? I mean, you guys are so bad, Santa Claus isn't going to come. He's not even going to leave you any coal. No. He's, not, he's just going to bypass the house altogether. No! No? You want Santa Claus to come? No. Last week you told me you didn't even want Santa Claus to come to our house. Oh, you don't want him to come to the house. Sorry, I guess you're not getting presents, boo. Heh. 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 Well, we'll take this one because uh, just double check should be 150 miles, right? Wow. Yeah, 150 miles. So we got we got two miles to stay out here. Yeah? So good. Wow. Because abs. Because. Wow. All right. So so the the trip distance doesn't include the drive to pick up the load. Okay. Well, I could have swore it did it in one instance. I thought it did, but maybe I guess I was wrong then. Oh, well. You got it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, isn't it? <laughs> I 
You would you would think, but sometimes it's not always the case, is it? Yep, there it is. Especially with this one here. That poke is I may eat it. Oh, I can't talk while you're eating? Okay. No. Alright, I didn't know my talking uh, disturbed your eating habits there, child. Oh, Alright, hold on here. Just I this. like that poop while I'm eating it yet. I apologize. Okay, people, we're going into... Uh, that poop is I'm eating, Daddy. Okay. And don't talk again, Daddy. Okay, don't say you Okay, you now. Oh, I can talk now? Yeah. Oops. Okay, thank you. Okay, that's talking. Oh, I have to stop talking now? <laughs> oh, so only when there's something in your mouth I can't talk. Okay. No, I'm, I'm, I'm not. I, I'm not ready yet, to eat yet, Daddy. Not ready yet. Okay. Okay, don't say words. I now can talk. Oh, now I can talk? Yeah. Good, because this is, this is okay, going to be a bit of Right here. Hey, Ed, that talk of I'm eating again. Okay. Yummy. Bad taste. It's down. Okay. Turn that down too. Stop talking and you gonna give me more. Oh, yes, I will get you more in oh. just a second oh, here. Stop talking. Okay. Okay, you can Yeah, she yeah. Come on, mouse. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. yeah she de she's extremely. Ex can uh, here, Aaron? Can you get her more while you're there, please? She's uh, extremely strong-willed, even at three years old. She's yeah, she's just, she's a handful. Now my aunt. Stop talking, who, my, Daddy, my aunt who lives out in Colorado. Yeah. I have to be able to talk, Abs. No, you don't want to Th talk. Then go in the other room and eat in your chair. No. I need to be able to talk. No, no, no. Well, I'm going to have to talk, Abs. That, that's no, what I do that's here. No, that's talking while I'm eating. Do not. Do not. I need to talk, no. Abs. No. Nope, don't touch. Don't touch. Sit down. <coughs> Sit down and eat. For something else breaks. But yes, my aunt in Colorado... Uh, once said that if she had her, she has two sons. I'm done, Daddy. And no, finish eating. She once said that if she had her second son first, 
she never would have had two kids. He would have been an only child. And that's sort of about the lines of how Aaron, or not Aaron, but Abby here uh, is. Aaron was a really good baby, she, nice quiet kid for the most part. You know, obviously, you know, she'd go, she, she'd go through the, the, you know, the young and tro troublesome twos and attitude, but she's never really, she's never really that bad of a kid. Abby, she is, wow. Wow, she is defiant, I, I, I would put it. I mean, uh, it's going to be scary with her when she gets older. Um, with her defiance and, and stubbornness, her strong will. Yeah. She's going to be a handful. But she's... I don't know. I, I don't know whether it's just me being amazed, or if she's just she seems she seems to be very very intelligent too. Um, because she seems to be able to to pick things up very quickly and without us showing her, like to put movies and stuff into the Blu-ray player and stuff like that. It's like, I, dude, I'm telling a story. You wait. Um, we never showed her how to do that, but she can do everything, pretty much every, she, everything on her own. Uh, I think the only thing she can't do right now is turn on the TV and, and, and get the TV channel to the, where, you know, to the, to the AV thing, to where it'll, you know, the Blu-ray comes up on it. But she can pretty much do everything else. Controls, get it in, get it playing. She knows when to start playing the movie. And we never showed her any of that. She just picked it up by watching us do it. So it's just make sure you're on top of her now when you tell her you it ain't the thing. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Ooh, hang on. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, we, we've always set the limits and stuff like that. We, you know, even with Aaron, you know, it's like, you know, you got to set the limits early. That's what we always done. But with Abby, she's still, I mean, she'll eventually, I mean, she, she'll put up her fight, but then she'll eventually listen or, or do what she's told for the most part. But yeah, that that's one of the things that uh, we wanted to do right out of the gate with them is, is make sure that they know there are limits you need to obey those limits and you need to listen when we tell you something now it's, now, it's actually now that Aaron's uh, almost a teenager being 12 years old now she's getting into that teenage defiance and uh, strong willedness so uh, usually we have to tell her three or four times and usually the last time is us yelling at her to do what we've been telling her to do something for the last half hour. But uh, yeah, for the most part we haven't had too many problems right now with either one of them. It's just, ex uh, was it exacerbating or, or exhausting? She's ex ex uh, exacerbated. I think that's the word. That fancy uh, $2 word I want to try to use there. Right now, fr frustrating uh, for certain, but yeah, kid, ooh, I can't reach that while I'm driving. Stupid, they learn fast if they, yes, absolutely, yeah, they do learn fast. But see, the funny thing is I don't remember Aaron. I mean, not not to say that Aaron is not intelligent. She's, she's very intelligent as well. But I just don't remember Aaron picking up on on that kind of stuff like that when she was younger. I mean, they both they they, they one thing that that is similar with the two of them is is buckling the car seat. Um, you know, Abby, Abby, you know, now, now when Abby gets in the car seat, she wants the, the buckle, the top buckle, and Aaron was the same way. He's like, I want to do it, I want to do it, and then eventually Aaron got to where she can buckle herself in. Um, so I'm sure Abby's going to get to that point too, but it, uh, that's one similarity I've noticed. 
with them, at least with the car seat and their, their, their independent will to want to be able to do that kind of stuff. But yeah, I'm still still kind of amazed that when Abby, you know, gets it in her mind that she wants to do something or, or something's going on, you know, she wants to do something, all of a sudden she she goes ahead and does what she needs to do to whatever it is, like, you know, she wants to watch a movie, so she'll set everything up. And all I have to do is turn the TV on and get to the right station. Um, she just goes ahead and does that stuff, even, you know, like I say, even though we never really, oh boy. Um, uh -huh. Oh, crikey. There we go. Oh, boy. <laughs> I lucked out that there was nobody else behind me there, but she, she'll just she'll just go and do it. And I'll, I'm just never see some easy. It's like how do you know how to do that? <sighs> yeah, yeah. Well, absolutely. Yeah, Aaron. She definitely looks up to Aaron. Um, Absolutely, and just, you know. So that's good, and, and we're lucky that Aaron tolerates her for the most part. You know, obviously. Yeah, you, you know, you have the oh crap. You know, it's there's not that sibling rivalry yet, but you know, you can see, you know, Abby is a lot to handle sometimes, so she does get on Aaron's nerves, like she gets on our nerves. But um, Marley shot it. Uh, but she she's 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 a very big helper especially for days like this when you know it's one of those days where I, I have the a chance to do some nice long streams instead of those you know hour and a half quick streams we gotta get it done because everything else we gotta get done uh, so Erin is very good in that regard that she she does help out without me having to do a lot of asking uh, for the help uh, so I can, you know, do streams like this on these days. So yeah, she she's definitely a good role model for the abs. Yes, yeah, that will come. Yeah, yeah, that was that was pure dumb luck there. That steering. And I, I've been fortunate up to this point that, that that's I've had to do like more more times than I would like uh, in those instances, and and so far, knock on wood, every single time I've been fortunate that there was a break in traffic and there was nobody behind me, so I could could get out of harm's way without you know running into somebody else. Well, why don't you finish your bowl here? Because I know you still got to be hungry. Well, I got all the potatoes in And and it's for I've been able to do that a couple of times in Euro, but more often than not, it's here. And fortunately, I have there's more room for error here than say on the streets of Europe. I've noticed. No, I got. I should have plenty of gas. I do want to see how much. Uh, there we go. Less than an hour. Okay. I'm just go look at our destination here again. Somebody smells like they need a diaper change. You need a diaper change? No. No. No, I pooing. Oh, you're you're pooing out. Want to go sit on the potty then? No. Well, that's the perfect opportunity to go sit on the potty. Oh, no. That's a little bit of poo. That's Just a little bit? Okay. Yeah, I'm going to go in on the potty and watch something on the phone. Well, you can't watch something on the phone because that's how I can see chat without completely I'm crashing. I'm sitting on Aaron's tablet. Yes, you can watch something on Aaron's tablet if you want to get on the potty. Go tell Aaron and she can put something up there for you. 
Yeah, now we're, now we're in the midst of potty training her. We're actually kind of a little bit behind on that regard. Uh, we actually had Erin potty trained when she was like two and a half. Um, so we're actually running behind because Abby just had her three-year checkup at the doctor's and he asked, he's like, oh yeah, she, yeah. Yeah, she should have been potty trained long before. But again, you know, that's just, with our schedules, it's it's just crazy. But uh, I'm glad, you know, she, she, she shows the willingness to learn it. So it's just a matter of we need a day to where it's going to be, it's going to have to be one of those days where I'm just not going to be able to stream. That way I can focus on getting her completely potty trained at this point. But uh, she's doing a good job with it. Uh, she's, you know, she's not showing any fear of the potty or anything like that, which is good. You know, Aaron, Aaron, we had potty trained, and then she sort of—I don't know what happened—but then she sort of lost it, and she developed a fear of the potty. But uh, she's back. She's back to normal now, fortunately. So we're I'm kind of kind of nervous. That I hope that we don't screw something up this time with Abby. Everything goes smoother with her. Oh no 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 no! Okay, I'm in trouble here. Yeah, I am in trouble here. Go go get out of the way! Get out of the way! Everybody move, cause I am. Yep, this is. I got to get down. <laughs> As I said before, thank God there are no viola no viola no other violations for the most part for <laughs> the things here. It's my God, I, I I would I would be in jail. Hey cat's back. Hey cat. Yeah, more narrow, more traffic. Although I I don't it's weird because it's I said this earlier today after I started uh, in American Truck here it's like and I was just inundated with traffic here out in the open desert road I'm like it's just incredible and like a few of the jobs that I were a couple of the jobs I did in Euro Truck it's like there was no traffic at all it's like to me sometimes it seems like there's a whole lot more traffic here in the middle of the desert than there is in the middle of Europe which just seems very very strange Looks like we will have to do a fuel up after uh, this job here. I don't know. You probably dropped it. It's probably under the table. That's what we heard. Crash. Well, I'm going a little bit fast around this turn here. That's there we go. Please don't break it. Not that it's ever going to be used because it's an old PS2 keyboard, but still. No need to break something just for the sake of breaking it. I pooed, Daddy. I want to get changed. You want to get changed? You don't want to sit on the potty now? You want to yeah. sit on the potty or no? Okay, we'll get you changed, which is kind of perfect timing since we're going to be switching out games here very shortly. I want to play with Play-Doh. Okay, that's fine. You can play with the Play-Doh. But I can't open it. Okay, well, you're going to have to get changed first anyway, so you're going to have to wait on that. No, I'm not I'm not ready Maybe we change play. games, run another quickie little... Uh... I'm not ready yet. I want to do a play play Okay. Well, no, you, you're not going to play and then get changed. You're getting changed before you play with the Play-Doh. I want to play with the Play-Doh. Uh, another little uh, Children's Hospital of Philadelphia video. Give me a chance to eat some lunch. And uh, we'll move on to Train Simulator here momentarily. Pull on in. 
entree. This one should be, f oh, hmm. Usually for uh, the Rail Express delivery, we just have to pull her straight on in here. We actually have to back this guy in. Okay, while we're here. Eh. They don't want to do it. The youngest son of my ex-sister-in-law is over three and a half and still... Wow. And, uh, yeah, well, well, that's the thing. Uh, my nephew was the same way. Um, no, another, like Abby, another headstrong kid, really intelligent. And he he just refused to do it. I don't th I don't think he got potty trained. I don't think he got potty trained. He, he was four. Cause he just he refused to do it. He, he, I think he told that my sister in law after his birthday he will, he will, he will sit on the potty. So yeah, but at least she, she's showing the willingness to do it. It's just a matter of, of, of when she's on there being able to relax enough to let something out at that point. I mean, that's her problem now. She has no problem sitting on it and, and, and trying, but she just, you know, you can tell she's not, she's not at that point where she's comfortable enough, relaxed enough to be able to let her body do what it needs to do while she's on the body. Oh yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, really yeah. Yeah, fortunately this isn't a super accurate simulator here. Because yeah, the number of, yeah. And, uh, okay, uh, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna have to do it this way. I guess this way. I'm gonna have to pull in this way. Oh, yeah, yeah, this is, this is, this is gonna be interesting. Okay. Alright. I can, I'm not close enough yet to be able to see where I really need to make my cut here. Which I'll probably, I probably already missed my opportunity here to see if we can, if we can get straightened out enough. Stop it here. Oh no, okay. It looks like we're still good on track here. But I still want to, nope. Nope, nope, wrong way, wrong way. Let's do this one. Just gotta watch I don't scrape my nose too badly here. Mm-hmm. Ooh, that's gonna be tougher than I thought here. I'm scraping my nose now. I, yeah, okay. I'm, I'm too far up. That's the problem. All right, let's try this again. I was about to say, yeah, and so some of the things, like being at this angle now, I, I don't think it's actually possible for a real truck to be at that angle without breaking your fifth wheel or, or detaching the trailer. I just I gotta make sure I give myself enough room here. All right, so I've got to pull further up, and then I can start cutting it. All right, go down this way. There we go. Start cutting it now. I should be pretty good shape here. Uh, I cut it too much. Alright. So I gotta do, I, I've gotta straighten out here is what I gotta do here. Straighten out here a bit. 
There we go. Okay, now we should be in a much better position here. Now, I'm not going to skip it because I'll have this. I'll get it now because I got enough nose room now. You know, to get her lined up here. I see you, Miss Hirsch. Okay, I'll do that way. It should be pretty much online. Yep, there we go. Oh, it's going to be a paint scraper. Ah, I got to straighten around again. This should be it. Oh, yeah, sorry, Hirsch. There's a mess all over the place, isn't it? Alright, come on. Come on. Come on, there we go. Hello, Hirschist. There we go. Uh, come on, cut, cut, cut. Alright, straighten her out one more time here. I should just be able to go straight back. I'm going to be a little off here, but I think we should be in good shape. Oh, that's as close to perfect as I think I've ever gotten yet. All right, there we go. Excellent, excellent. We got her in there. We squeezed her in. All right, let's tee that off. Yeah. Yeah. Taz says, hello, Hershey. Oh, here she comes again. Hello, oh, hello, Hershey. Hello, Hershey. You going to climb on my shoulder again, Hersh, and claw me up? Nope. You can't. What did you just do, Abs? <laughs> Thanks. I did not see what happened there, Abs. Hello, Hershey. Hello, Hershey. <laughs> There's, the There's the cat in the camera. <laughs> That's a big Hershey. That's a big Hershey. Yes, yeah, she is. Yeah. Don't finish eating. She's not going to watch her tail. The cat's tail has a mind of its own. All right, so let's see here. Um, three out of six. Good. All right, we managed to get three deliveries in. Not quite the six I was hoping for today. But, uh, yeah. Alright, let's go ahead and save that. And save it right there. Perfect. Boom. Boom. So... Oh, I didn't mark that up. Gallop. Okay, that was Gallop, I do believe. Yep, alright. So that was our trip to Gallop. Excellent. We got Hirsch. We got Hirsch. We got Hirsch. Right, I got an alt tab out of here. Right to there. So, three... Dash to Gallop. All right, we're a quarter of the way there in each of our games now. Excellent. 